Yo, what is going on YouTube? Welcome back to a brand new video. In today's video, I got this insane gift cards to friends for you that is so easy to do. Literally, like I said, you can do it in your sleep. That's why you want to watch the whole video every single minute of the video so you don't miss a single step. Also, make sure to go ahead and actually subscribe to my channel if you have not already. So that way you are kept up to date with all the content happening on there. As well as a like in today's video would be greatly appreciated. As well, make sure to join the Discord GTA Hub as that way you can literally find a bunch of people to actually help you with a bunch of these here videos on the channel and yeah now all out of the way let's go right into the video yo if you're looking for the best gta 5 services as well as modder accounts all that their good stuff for gta 5 then be sure to check out messy modding for literally the best stuff to do with gta where that be on xbox ps4 or pc he literally has everything with modder accounts cash drops Anything account services, he's got it over on Messy Modern, so definitely be sure to go in the description down below and check him out. So the requirements for this is simply have an arena, as well as an MOC with a personal vehicle storage in the back, and then just put any car in the back of your MOC. From there, make your way to the arena and simply enter to B1 Garage. Now once you do that, you have your friend, then all they want to do is start up time of a job, and then as you're... Uh, getting your friend to start up time of a job just be aware that there could be an alert actually come up when they actually do join time of a job so if you are running just keep that in mind because you could accidentally accept it now you just want to make your way to the elevator and hover over workshop level once your friend's in time of a job then all you want to do is join off their profile as invites usually don't work anymore depending on if your ps4 xbox i've heard that invites don't actually work uh, with this glitch consistently that's why I say join off their profile and then all you want to do is quickly as soon as you hit join profile you want to enter the elevator and you should get the alert to actually join the job and you accept that and if you've done it all correctly you will actually be entering the arena workshop level actual animation as well as joining the job that your friend is currently in now if you actually the best way to actually know how you actually hit this is when you're actually in the job itself as you can see your screen will actually flash black that is how you know you hit this here correctly and uh, if you can't see that simply just quit the job now when you go ahead and actually spawn back into gta you will actually spawn outside for a millisecond and then it will actually take you into the workshop level now if it does in fact do that there then all you simply want to do is get in any single car that is in your workshop level do not worry, you do not lose this car, it's literally just so you can get out of the actual arena. So simply, like I said, just get in any random car that you do have, uh, and then just simply drive it out. Now when you do want to go to drive it out, all you want to do is drive it up onto the hill part, and then simply just pull up your interaction menu, and simply do the easy way out. Now once you do in fact respawn after that, that is when you want to tell your friend just to quit out of the time of a job, and actually return back to GTA. Now this is where you want to simply make your way back over to the arena and get in the car and then all you want to do is once you are in fact in your car again just simply turn it around and this is where you want to drive back to your arena and you want to drive really fast into the door and accept the first alert to actually enter the arena workshop and as you hit A then you want to spam Y so that way you actually do get kicked out of the car and then you do actually see you actually fall under the map now when you respawn simply go ahead and get in any street car or if your friend is actually waiting outside the arena simply just get inside their car. Now all you want to do is make your way over to the postal office in GTA and then have your friend park on the grass actually opposite the pink house and then all you want to do is then go over to the pink house and request a personal vehicle. Now this personal vehicle you will in fact lose so preferably use one that you do not care about and then you also want to spawn in your MOC. Now all you want to do is simply have your friend get inside your car and what your friend wants to do is have their personal vehicle set to passengers. It must be passengers on that, or this will actually not work. So make sure your friend has set to passengers and now once they're in your car have them go to story mode and get that alert and have them sitting on that alert. Now once they have the alert all you want to do is drive to the back of your MOC and actually hit enter the MOC. And then simply just accept that alert and if you don't correctly your friend will get kicked out of the car. 
if your friend gets kicked out, simply just drive back and then simply get out of your car and then pull up the story mode to get the alert. Once you've got the alert, decline that and now this is where you want to walk to the back of your MOC and actually hit enter alone. Now once you do hit enter alone, then all you want to do from there is simply hold down in your D-pad. Now once you hold down your D-pad, simply flick up on your stick and then if you've done it correctly, you will actually get an alert uh, saying that you want to go to story mode, simply just decline that alert. Now once you decline that alert, you'll actually be thrown underneath the map and then when you actually do respawn, it'll actually be invisible and then all you want to do from there is simply then get in your friend's car and since he has it on passengers, then you'll be sucked in to the actual bike your MOC and that's it done. Then all you want to do is simply walk out of your MOC and simply go to services and request your personal vehicle out of the MOC and that's you done. You now have got your friend's car in GTA 5 very very easy and that's it for today's video, Venom plays, bye.